air temperature is sitting right at 9 degrees. You can see actually a little bit of light snow being reported at Epley this morning. The good news is there's not too much wind, but areas that are seeing wind are, and are seeing temperatures down in the single digits most likely have wind chills down below zero, but you can see Norfolk right now seeing a temperature just of zero. Harlan's at three, Plattsmouth is at 10, so you go a little bit further south and east and temperatures are in the middle teens, but all of us looking at single digits here as we head through the next few hours. So it is cold out there on dual pole super Doppler. You can see just a little bit of white in West Omaha, some limited visibility just right around three, four or five miles and maybe a little bit of light snow. That's what they're seeing at Epley as well. So that's something to keep in mind. We are tracking some pretty big changes though. We saw some snow yesterday by three o'clock this afternoon. We'll just see clear skies across the Omaha Metro and you can see those arrows coming in out of the south. Some warmer air. What that means as we head into the day tomorrow, actually some warmer temperatures, but we are going to see those winds pick up as we head into the afternoon hours on Sunday. Some cloud cover build in and then take a look at that cold front. 1.30 Monday morning, we'll start to see that cold front move in, maybe bringing us just a little bit of snow as it moves through. A better chance to see rain and snow down to our south though as we head into Monday afternoon. You can see in Omaha a little bit of snow just north and off to the west. Those winds though continue to build in. This is midnight, so this is the New Year's Eve. This is right at midnight as we switch over into 2019. We're looking at strong winds on the backside of that cold front and much colder air. So temperatures here as we head through the day today, they'll climb up into the mid 20s, stay relatively constant overnight tonight. Tomorrow, this model has high temperatures close to about 39 degrees. I actually think we'll see highs close to about 42. Then those winds change direction. They're coming in out of the south. We'll see highs on Monday between about 10 and noon. And then the temperatures just drop into the new year. By the new year, we'll see air temperatures close to about 10, cooler off towards the north. By early Tuesday morning, air temperatures sitting close to about six with those stronger winds. Looks like we could see wind chills between about negative 10 off towards the north, closer to negative 20. So we're looking at some cold conditions as we head into the new year. It's not a great chance to see that snow as we head into the day on Monday, but something to watch. Most of us should just see a dusting. The good news is we'll see a little bit of a warm up before that cold air builds in. Then it will cool down on Monday with that colder air. So it's a 40% chance for some light snow. Highs on Tuesday just climbed close to about 15 degrees. Then we'll see those temperatures climb just a little bit more as we head into the end of the seven day forecast Thursday and Friday. We'll see high temperatures climbing up into the mid and the upper 40s. So a pretty nice change there, but New Year's Eve is looking very cold.